Hi everybody, Sonia Rollins here for Chamber Spotlight. We're excited to be here today. Normally we're talking food, but today we're talking fitness. I'm here with Brendan Stapleton, owner, operator of Fitness Together Burlington. He has been here for just about 16 years. Brendan, thank you for joining us. Thank you for having me. I'm thrilled to have you because here's the truth. Everybody drives by here and sees Fitness Together. You're in a very prominent spot on Cambridge Street. And I'm excited to kind of have people see the inside. You're going to get to show them what it's like to be here. Talk personal training, talk health. Hopefully you can give everybody some good pointers. It's not all about just working out or just what you eat. There's a mixture to make the perfect science of being healthy. Oh yes. yeah, it's a, it's a true mix of exercise, nutrition, cardiovascular health, and everybody's here for different reasons. Some folks are here mainly for the accountability because they don't like working out. They want to work out in a safe space. They yes. don't want to get hurt. Other folks don't want to go to a big box gym and be sort of on the floor with 50 or 60 other people. Client-wise is here for you know numerous different things. It could be nutrition-based, it could be cardio-based, it could be rehab and after an injury. People have signed themselves up for an event and now they have to do it and they say, okay, how do I get from the starting line to the finish line? You know, and then just regular folks that just want to just be healthy. It's kind of amazing. Talk to me about the model of Fitness Together because the model of Fitness Together, like you said, is for maybe someone who doesn't want to go to a larger gym, but you have two different types of models in here. Talk about that a little yeah, bit. So we hit 95% private personal training and then we have a small group, four to six people group training that we have in the morning and nights, but the 95% of what we do is all one-on-one -on -one private training, you know, in a private suite where you're not, again, with anybody else, it's just you and your trainer. It's all customized based on someone's schedule right there, when they can get in here, right, what their life's like, do they travel for work? It's individualized. So we see some folks twice a week, so we see other people four times a week. So it's really what fits in their world yes. and what makes the most sense for them. Yeah. So we still have clients that even live local that just now have built a home gym and they can get in and out before the kids wake up and then we have some folks that live you know across the country and around the world that we just adjust for their time zones and we still see them uh, virtually via zoom or or google or even facebook sometimes we concentrate really fitness over 40 and then we also train a little bit of sports specific so running or triathlon but we also have younger athletes kids that are going into college college age coming out of college yes. that just looking for healthy routines yeah and a lot of it's the coaching comes down to that one-on-one -on -one and just meeting the person where they're at and then helping them get to the next you know progress point in their in their journey community those who know you personally or those who've been around you or those who've been involved with the chamber and see you you and your team are very involved in the community yeah I mean, so i've been a trainer for almost 20 years and, I've yeah. been, and the goal is to affect as many lives as possible we take that right outside the doors, right? Whether it's food drives or helping out with families in need during the holidays yes. or other different things. And we have a good time doing it in regards to some of the different ventures we've come across and different funds we support. But it's really about just being a pillar of the community right. and truly making a positive impact where you can, yeah. right? Do what you can, when you can, for as long as you can. And our goal is always to bring people together, right? Sometimes people don't want to go to a big box gym because they may be the lone wolf of their you know, community, they don't really know anybody. Yeah. Right? So when people come here, we want the clients to be introduced to each other. People have made lasting friendships, have met folks just doing, you know, their warm up and five, six years later, they're out, you know, having coffee, they're part of the same book club, they're playing bridge together, they're going for walks, it's right? They, they schedule so they know that they're gonna see the same people all the time, right? So we try to bring community to those folks who may or may not have their own communities and feel like they're getting lost in the crowd. All right, folks, there you have it. Brendan Stapleton, owner, operator, Fitness Together Burlington, located here on Cambridge Street. For Chamber Spotlight, I'm Sonia Rollins.